Hey, Rainbow here, and welcome to my channel. Behind me, you can see the Ducati Multistrada V4 Pike Speak. This is the single-sided swing arm back here, and uh, what's missing is this tire right here that I did a little video about. A little over 3,600 miles on the Pirelli Diablo Rosso 4, Rosso 4 tire, and um, yeah, that's all she wrote. This uh, tire has seen better days in about 3,600 miles. I was expecting to get about 4,000 or so, but I did do one track day and, uh, you know, the tire took some abuse. Anyway, with that being said, I went and I took the tire off and figured, hey, I'll just take it on Monday, go get a new tire, get one put on, and that'll be the end of it. So, um, dealers closed. I'm not sure that they're going to have one in stock. So I figured, you know what? It's my day off on Monday. Let me go ahead and get a tire from somewhere else. I called the local cycle gear and they said, uh, not only do they not have the tire, but their tire changing machine, which has been down for weeks, um, is still down. And apparently big corporation like cycle gear can't get the West Palm beach um, tire machine up and running. They said it was gonna be another couple of weeks. So I said, hey, are you working with anyone else? And they said, uh, no, you can try the other one down in Lauder Hill, which is down in Fort Lauderdale. So I can either go 20 minutes north to the West Palm or I can go 40 minutes south to the Lauder Hill. So I called Lauder Hill and I said, hey, do you have the Ducati Diablo Corso 4s in stock? And they said, Yes, we do. And I said, oh, cool. Could you change it for me today? They said, yes, we can. So I said, I'll be right there and I'll hold my place. I said, there's one more person in front of you. I'm like, hold my place. So what I did is I went down to Lauder Hill, drove 40 minutes and walked in and brought in my tire. And he looked, took one look at it and he goes, oh, what kind of rims are those? And I said, those carring. Marcassini, right? Marcassini rims. They're just forged aluminum rims. And he goes, yeah, sorry, we can't change those. That's company policy. I'm like, what do you mean you can't change them? Why didn't you ask me what kind of rims I had before I drove for 40 minutes? And he said, um, company policy, they're just too expensive and it's too much liability. So um, word to the wise, don't bother taking uh, your rims to cycle gear if you have a single-sided swing arm with marcanese rims or uh marcassini rims i mean anyway so uh he said well you know what since you drove all the way down here if you're okay with it you'll sign something he goes i'll go ahead and i'll change it he goes but i can't balance it and i'm like well what do you mean you can't balance it and he said well we don't have the adapter to do this. He said, we could do single-sided swig arm for like a BMW because they have like the five mounting lugs here. But apparently um, they can't do this mark and easy on a Ducati single-sided swing arm, which I didn't know. So I'm not really sure exactly uh, how much that's gonna help anyone. So Cycle Gear is a little disappointing that they'll sell the tire, uh, can't and refuse to mount it on a Marquinhos, uh, Marquesini Ford's rim because of liability, and they also won't do any of the other type of rims, the uh, yeah, carbon fiber, they won't do them. Eh, that part I can almost understand, but not really. I mean, if you're gonna do it, you're gonna do it. Uh, anyway, so they said, well, we do have the, the, the tire in stock, and I said, you know what? I'll just buy the tire. If I drove 40 minutes down here, let me buy the tire. So I went ahead and I bought a brand new Pirelli, and now, um, I have to piss off my dealer tomorrow because I'm going to take it to the dealer and have them mount the tire on it and balance it for me since it's a Ducati dealer and obviously they have the ability to do this. So, would be nice. So, the reason why I bought it at Cycle Gear is because I can't guarantee when they open up tomorrow, because they were closed today, that my dealer is going to have this tire in stock. So, I just said... Screw it, I'm just gonna buy it. Anyway, lesson learned, um, my weekend off didn't work out too well uh, for the holiday because I can't get this tire mounted. 
and uh, some people can't even do this. So then I even called another, uh, one of the largest motorcycle dealers that handles all kind of brands, Honda, Yamaha, Kawasaki, and they're open and I said, hey, how much to change my tire? They said 90 bucks to change it and balance it. And I go, that's a little steep. I go, it's a Marconisi Forge rim from a single set of swing arm. He goes, yeah, I can't do it. So uh, interesting how you have something like this and you're very limited on where you can take it. I did find out that for like a hundred bucks, they make a, a, an axle with the cone for this thing. It's a piece of cake to add it to any balancer. So. I could balance it if I had the machine, it's not a big deal, it's just a matter of changing it and breaking the bead and that's the problem. Anyway, Saga continues over something simple, like a tire, hopefully tomorrow I can get it taken care of, but I'm gonna have to uh, take some time off of work, which wasn't really wasn't what I was planning on doing tomorrow. Anyway, this is Rainbow. here's an update, that's how things work around here, I guess, and uh, Cycle Gear, very disappointed. Very disappointed. So, hey, you made a sale at least, right? You just don't want to uh, change them, but you need to uh, advertise that so we know. All right, this is Rainbow. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you, and have a good day. Bye-bye.